Hey, what's going on people? Welcome back to my channel, it's Pop Mix, coming at you with another unboxing video. Today's video, we're gonna unbox this big box we got from Funko Shop, which is full of NYCC New York Comic Con Pops. Super hyped for this. Before we get into that, make sure you do like and comment down below. Let me know which pops of these that you like. Let me know how your NYCC came out, if you guys got any certain pops that you guys are looking for, um, or if you like any of the ones that I got. And make sure that you also subscribe to my page if you haven't already, so you can stay up to date with the rest of my videos. Check me out over on Instagram as well, at pop underscore migs. As soon as you get a chance, I really appreciate it. Follow me on the social media platform, just so you can stay up to date with some of my posts and stuff that's going on there. So I'm excited for this. I, of course, ordered this. So NYCC was earlier this month. They had on Thursday, the 8th, I believe it was, the if you won the raffle, you were able to go onto the Funko shop and get certain all the pops with the actual New York Comic Con stickers on there. I unfortunately, like many, did not get that. So then for Friday the 9th, they decided to do the retailers where you can also go back onto Funko Shop and get the same pops or whatever was left over, but with the retailer fall convention stickers, basically. Or you can go to the actual retailer sites or stores like Target, Walmart, Barnes & Noble, Box Lunch, etc., just to get the specific ones that actually were you know, exclusive to those stores. So I happened to go online Friday. I didn't have a chance to go into any of the stores and I decided to go straight to Funko. So I went on Funko and, and honestly, it wasn't that bad, but as soon as I went on, I thought it was gonna be a, like craziness that happened in San Diego Comic-Con and all the crashing and everything. And in the beginning it was like loading and I'm like, oh my God, I'm talking to one of my friends and he sent me a screenshot, he has the same thing. And I'm like, what's going on? It was a few minutes. And then as, as soon as it popped up, all of a sudden it just popped up and you see all the pops. And they didn't have every single one directed through Funko because of course they sold out a lot from the day before, but they had pretty much the majority of them. So I went on and I was just like clicking and adding to cart with a bunch of them. And uh, there was only one, which is a Danny Phantom that I didn't get, which is one of the ones that I clicked on and during the cart process it said it was actually like sold out or whatever. But for the most part, I got everything that I wanted. So I wasn't like, crazy hype about like a ton of these ones that are going for so much money and resellers and everything because i don't really do that i'm just collecting for myself so out of the personal ones that i wanted i honestly got pretty much everything i wanted the only one i didn't get which they didn't have on the funko shop at that time was the uh, carl and ellie two pack from up which was sold through box lunch and i didn't get a chance to get over to box lunch and when i tried it was already sold out i know they've done a couple of restocks but They've been like in store and I haven't, you know, really been able to get to one of those stores early enough. They sell pretty fast. I know that pops value is going up a ton, but let's move this box down. So, so Funko does like to ship these boxes. So I think I got five pops, maybe six, I'm not sure. So, We'll see. I guess we'll check out these two first. These are really light. And then we'll, we'll open up this box after. All right, so let's see what we got here. First pop from NYCC, New York Comic Con, or Virtual Con, really, because I didn't have the actual con, is... Ah, yeah, I was so hyped for this. So the... This is, oh, oh, let's go. So I actually got, this is actual sticker. Okay, this is, be so this is even better. So this is Beetlejuice. So this was the glow in the dark Beetlejuice exclusive. So this is him and he's got the, you know, handbook for the recently dece deceased in his hand. And of course this one does glow in the dark. So this is a huge addition to my collection being, you know, Beetlejuice fan, horror, Halloween, you know, most of you know, most of my collection, a lot of it is that. And this is a super cool pop. But if you notice, this is the official New York Comic-Con 2020 exclusive limited edition sticker, which I did not think I was gonna get let's see what the rest of these are but i thought well i guess it was like technically a chance that you can get the the actual sticker versus the shared but it wasn't guaranteed more likely it was going to be the shared but he is kind of 
Gotta take a look at his insert in a second. He looks like he's kind of like popping. I don't know if he's in here crooked or not. Let's take like a look at him since he's out. There he is. Super cool. So. Let's go. Super hyped for that one. So that's the first one. So let's see number two. I don't like these, like these little these weird sorters that they put them in. Sometimes we got another one. All right. So this is marbles. Mar marbles. What? This is Marvel Zombies. And this is the Zombie Daredevil. So if you guys know, I have majority of the Marvel Zombie line. I really like it. It's cool. It's, you know, Marvel related, but I like the, the, the molds. I like what they do with the zombie figures. And it's very similar to horror related as well. So it's another reason why I got into it. But I really like this one. I know it wasn't like a super hot commodity. It was one of those, because I know I was checking back in to see just what else they had and and a lot of the stuff was selling out pretty quick and then some of the stuff was still kind of sticking around and i know this is one of the ones i've seen a lot of people get and it wasn't you know like super wanted but i like it i mean it's cool i like the look of them so it is one of the old school looking you know daredevil all right he's got the little cane in his hand so it's super cool and again i did get the official new york comic-con sticker instead of the fall exclusive sticker so that's six so that's two pops that i got with that so that's pretty awesome so i'm actually excited that they came with that exclusive sticker so of course value wise the sticker i mean it's the same exact pop same exact box and you guys know already when it comes to cons and exclusives and stuff like that it's literally the same it's just the sticker that's different so the uh, shared exclusive sticker is kind of longer up and down versus that side and it does have I do like it though because it does have the Statue of Liberty and it'll say like fall convention 2020 shared exclusive uh, this one's just the actual New York Comic Con so but just for that itself it gives a pop more value it was you know I guess more exclusive there was less of them but it's cool to have it <laughs> especially when I didn't think I was gonna get any of them so these next few um i don't know if they're going to be like that or not but it is so three more so they did put them in sorter so uncle's been really good with their shipping lately um boxes i just don't like those those like big cardboard ones that those came in i mean they come in good shape but it looks pretty much like all the boxes are pretty mint uh the daredevil so this one's pretty mint. There, those got a couple little nicks on the two bottom corners, but nothing too crazy. This one's super heavy. So I don't remember. I don't know what two. Oh, I gotta do it. Okay. So I, I remember what these should be. So I wonder if they actually say it on them. Because normally they do with when they're from Funko. They don't. So. Oh, they do. Okay, yeah. So I do. I want to do that one last. Let's take a look. Boom. Got there. That is the pizza rat. So this is uh, windows all scuffed up. Oh man, it's got a little bit of coloring on it. So if you notice, so this is New York Comic Con exclusive icon, the pizza rat. I love this one. He's a little pizza with a blue hat. And he does have the pizza with NYC written on it. So that's cool. Of course, New York, very well known for pizza. There you go. Love the back too. The NYCC is in like the pizza with pepperoni. So if you notice, this is the shared sticker. So it's actually is the other way. I thought it was up and down. But for this one, uh, 2020 fall convention, limited edition with the sticker. So that's not the official sticker like the other two, but still an awesome pop. I love what they did. So I got that one. So that's an icon. And then this was the other icon. This is the heavy one, I guess, because of who he is. So this is the pigeon. So these were the two icons that came out for New York City Comic Con specifically. 
And this guy's got a ton of weight. Pauly Pigeon. And on the back's got the Funko Graffiti. That guy's got like the brick on the box near Comic Con at the top. But this is also shared exclusive sticker. But both of these, if you notice on their windows, they're like scuffed up. I'm not sure if you can see. So on this one, he's like orange. Almost, I wonder if I can clean it from the inside. It looks like it's from the pop, like maybe moving and the color. And then the same thing with this one. He's got a couple marks here. It's almost like, you know. But two icons. Probably those are cool. I mean, they're very exclusive to the Comic Con and, you know, being a pigeon or a rat. If you know you're in New York or from New York, or you know about New York City or work there like I do, you know the pigeon and the rat is a big, big symbol of New York. So it was cool that they did that. I like the look of them, especially with pizza. Super cool. And this one he's like a superhero. All right, so the last one here is, of course, if you haven't seen a previous video, I do have this collection. I posted actually on my Instagram. So if you take a look at my Instagram, you'll see an IGTV video I put up a couple weeks back of all of these pops minus this one i did speak about it then this is of course the breast cancer line so the breast cancer awareness line that came out from dc super cool so batman batgirl was an exclusive to target um but the original four was batman superman wonder woman and harley quinn so those are the four that originally came out then batgirl came out as an exclusive to target and then this one was honestly the most desired pop that I had from New York Comic Con. So out of all of them, the Beetlejuice was very high up there. Daredevil was cool. Like I said, a zombie. These were just kind of essentially because of the coolness and, you know, the, the fit of them into the NYCC. But this was definitely the top one that I wanted. If a lot of you guys know, I am an enormous Joker fan. So the fact that I saw when this one was being released as the Joker, oh, I was hoping that he came as the, the actual... NYCC, because that one's got a lot of value. But, oh, I love this one. So, love these pops specifically, and I love Joker. So I'm definitely a huge fan of what they did with these, with the pink. This is the classic look. So this is like the older classic Joker, which I do have the you know normal version of this one, this classic look. Love the box, pink box, just like the other ones. And then he has his own little logo on the top it says joker of course they put their little thing on the back but this one's cool so this was a shared exclusive uh so i did get three that came in as shared exclusives two actual comic-con stickers so that's still pretty cool so i'm i'm psyched for that i love the pops that came in i was excited for these i've had these for a little bit they came uh well i ordered them obviously back in the beginning of october they came in just about like a week ago or so and I was super hyped uh, for them, but I don't know how I actually held on to not opening the box. So I wanted to make sure I got a good video for you guys. So I was able to do them, but, but I got them open. I'm excited. Thank you guys so much for another great video. Please make sure, like I said before, like, comment down below. Let me know which ones of these are you like. Let me know what you guys got. What were your favorite NYCC pops? Did you, were you able to actually get some of these exclusive uh, con stickers or the share stickers? You know, I got a little mix. So either way, I'm, I'm excited for what I got. Make sure you subscribe down below as well if you haven't already so you can stay up to the, with my content. And check me over at Instagram at pop underscore Migs as well. Like I always say, make sure you guys are staying safe. And until next time, I'm going to come back with another video for you guys. Take it easy.